Hi everyone, it's Grandma Jackie. I'm back and I've got a Sam's Club um, haul for you so we can get stuff put away. I'm wearing my shirt today that says, you can't scare me, I have grandkids. <laughs> so that, I just thought that was cute. Um, <clears throat> my husband and I went and we did a bunch of shopping that we needed to do, get some groceries and stuff. He got this big pack of chips. Um, I can't tell you what the prices are because I don't really remember and I don't know where the receipt is. It's somewhere. So it does come, it says classic mix and it does come with 50 bags. There are 16 Cheetos, 12 classic chips, 10 Doritos, 8 Fritos, and 4 sour cream and onion. So he did get that. I told him that I just picked him up a a big bag of it at Walmart the other day and he almost didn't get it but I was like you should probably go ahead because <clears throat> I'm sure that's our last trip to Sam's this year and can I just say they still don't have TP which is ridiculous but <clears throat> thank goodness my Dollar Tree does let me just keep stocking up on it we got two packages this is his favorite bacon of the Members Mark restaurant style bacon. Um, it's 10 pounds. He splits this up and we have one of those, what do you call it? Uh, seal, uh, uh, I can't think. It seals the bags, sucks the air out, seals the bags. I can't even think of what the name of it. But anyways, um, he does that and we have like a a big basket thing in our freezer that he does it in different packs for because we do sometimes we have bacon for breakfast sometimes we'll have BLTs I mean it it just depends um, but he did get two of these and these are I want to say they're maybe $39 something like that so, yeah but it lasts us forever so he did get two of those we got a big thing of the jumbo raw shrimp I think I know this was over $10 but I don't remember how much but this is the shrimp that we cook on the grill mm, really good and he seasons it just right too so and then we did pick up a big pack of little smokies um, I don't remember how much this is either I'm sorry but um, since it's the holidays, we like to put these in the crock pot. We have our own little recipe. Um, actually, whenever we first got married, um, we had an elderly woman um, that took care of the Legion here in town. Um, I think she's since passed away. But she made um, her own recipe of her little wieners there at our reception. And they were so good and she gave me the recipe and we've been using it ever since so bless her heart we absolutely love it there's ketchup and brown sugar involved <laughs> but it's good it's really good the longer you cook it on low the better it is okay I know I did need spoons the other day and I went and I picked up two packs at the Dollar Tree but those are not gonna last me all year like I usually get this from Sam's and I had ran out I still have my set of forks I still have a bunch of those but my spoons I had ran out of so <clears throat> and we have just plastic forks and spoons down here for like if we're gonna grab something quick we just do that so I did get that Then I picked up a pack of these mini um, peppers. You can eat these, just just eat them. Or you can dip them in hummus, or you can dip them in ranch if you like ranch. Um, sometimes I dip them in that um, Olive Garden dressing. Oh gosh, yes. And you can smell them right through the bag, they smell so good. Mm. So yes, I usually I usually get a bag of these um, about every other time that I go to Sam's. 
because I'll get these at Aldi's quite a bit. I, uh, we needed this for Thanksgiving, so we did get some um, chicken stock. Be able to cook his noodles, in which he is cooking his noodles. This is the Q-tips my husband gets. I really do not use Q-tips, um, but he does. Uh, I am a firm believer in that if it's bigger than your elbow, you're not sticking it in your ear. But he does. So, I can't argue with him. He has his own ways. Um, this is the deodorant that he gets. Um, we kind of stay stocked up on it, so he got himself another one of those. This is the one that I get, and um, I think I had one more left in in my stock, in my closet, so we needed another one of those. Now, my husband and I don't eat a lot of ketchup, but my grandkids do. Um, we ran out of ketchup the other day. We had to run and get a bottle. I couldn't believe how expensive it, it was at the IGA, and so... We're almost out of that bottle, <laughs> and I was like, um, we're getting ketchup. <laughs> like, seriously. Um, the date on this is 11-14 of 21. I'm pretty sure they're going to go through this. Pretty sure. But, yes. Ketchup. And then, I know the ranch dressing that we have in the refrigerator is almost gone because Gracie and Riley had pizza last night after we got back from trick-or-treating. We made Dollar Tree pizzas. And I knew that was almost gone, and I didn't think we had another one in our pantry. I wasn't sure, but I didn't want to take a chance. So this is the ranch that we get. We always get the Hidden Valley Ranch, and we just got it in the two-pack. The date on this is September 10th of 21st, or 21. So, yeah, that'll be gone, too. So we're not going to have to worry about that. <laughs> Get this one up here. I'm almost done. We didn't didn't really get a whole lot. I mean, we paid a lot for it, but it didn't seem like we got a lot. Um, I did pick this up for Lala. Um, the tag says twenty dollars. I want to say it was like seven dollars, but it's a size two. It's little feety pajamas. So I did pick up a little warm set of jammies for her. A lot of times I'll pick up the the clothes and stuff there because I really I think they're cute outfits. Picked up a two pack of the Wonder Bread. I'm a Wonder Bread eater. I am. Whenever they took all their stuff off the shelves and everything, I didn't know what I was gonna do. Then they brought all their you know other stuff back, and the Wonder Bread wasn't back yet. So, anyways, that's a whole nother story. My husband picked this up, 32 count, um, 16 Twinkies and 16 Ding Dongs. Yeah, that's a lunch thing. Ooh. Got these and I haven't tried these before. Um, let me know if you guys have tried it and tell me, tell me because I'm kind of leery about trying new fruits, but this is the Sun Gold Kiwi. And it's like a, a yellowish kiwi. It says, cut, scoop, and enjoy. So, it's supposed to be sweeter than the green kiwi. And it says, three times the vitamin C of an orange. So, we got that to try. And they're fairly good size in there. And they look like a great big old baked potato, but I don't know. We'll give it a try. I got these um, melting wafers because of my dollar, no, not my Dollar Tree haul, my Ollie, Ollie's haul, um, I got a candy melt, so I needed this for my candy melt, and it's the Garadelli, is that how you say that, dark chocolate flavored melting wafers, not only that, but I did need this for those pretzel things. I think that would be in a dollar to help in that. Um, 
pecan halves. Um, I don't, I don't know how to explain it, but we have kind of, it isn't in our area, but we always travel to it. This year it was canceled because, you know, social distancing, but it's the Covered Bridge Festival. Um, it's over in Indiana, and um, we usually go to it every year. They have this awesome, like, roasted sweet pecans, cashews, all kinds of different nuts, but that's what I always refer to as the pecan house because I found that recipe and I've been making them for years ever since I found that recipe so this is my intention for that and whenever I bought them little cups the other day that had the lids I said I was gonna take stuff to work nuts and stuff to work but this is something that I'm taking once I get to cooking it <clears throat> Probiotic. We always get that there. It's the cheapest I've found so far. Dull mixed cherry fruit. There's 16 cups. This was what I wanted. Now he always gets. I'll show you. He always gets this. The diced peaches. 24 cups. The members mark. This is what he always gets. I like peaches. Don't get me wrong, I really like peaches, but I like pineapple and like cherries and everything in mine too. So I did get that. Then I got this, and this was five something. I don't know how good of a deal that is, but there was 150 sheets in here, and there's assorted designs, and so I did get that. Two more ribbons. Got the green, and these are for 50 yards. This is one and a half inch 50 yard. Just the green sparkly. And this is the two and a half inch 50 yard. And it's the red with the green trim. I thought these would look really good together. I want a wreath. So I did get that. I'm gonna do that as much my stuff. And that was it. Besides for we did get um, like I think a case of Dr. Pepper, um, a case of Coke. Um, what else did we get? Maybe that was it. A case of Dr. Pepper, a case of Coke. Um, anyways, that was it for my Sam's haul. Um, we just got back and I had to let my phone charge a little bit because we was out of the area and it drained my phone. Um, today is Halloween. It is the last day of October and next month is November already. <laughs> so tomorrow we also, in our area, we also um, set our clocks back. I turn the clocks back an hour at two o'clock in the morning tomorrow. So that daylight savings time, I don't know what you call it. But anyways, we do that tomorrow. Um, <clears throat> I hope everyone is having a good day. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up for me. That really helps out my channel. I appreciate everybody clicking and watching. Um, I do have a few Dollar Tree hauls and then also an Ollie's haul because we always, whenever we go there, we always go to Ollie's as well. And then I got just a couple of things that, from Marshalls and Ross, I think. Yes. Yes. The town that we went to did not have a Target. I was really wanting to go to Target, but that's okay. I'll get there eventually. I will. <laughs> so if you haven't already subscribed to the channel, please think about subscribing. And once you do, make sure you hit the bell and that will tell you whenever I upload a video. Um, like I said, I really appreciate you clicking on my video and watching my video. And I appreciate all the new subscribers that I have and the ones that have been around since the beginning. Thank you very much for your continued support. I really appreciate it. Um, I hope everyone is having a good day and they're staying safe. And I will talk to you later.